Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 27th of September 2025, I hope you are keeping well. It's evening time, early evening here in Bangkok. Uh, but I heard the sound of distant thunder a short time ago and I think the weather forecast is for uh, a storm. So I better play this game before that begins. Getting really bored with the rain at the moment actually in Bangkok, it's driving me nuts. Uh, stopping me from sleeping and, and amongst other things causing making it difficult to get to work etc uh, rain rain go away come back some other time please that doesn't rhyme does it um, what's going on or what has been going on in the world over the last week RFK Jr. has been opening his mouth and more nonsense has been coming out uh, he has stated uh, that um, what we in the West in most countries in the world I should say call refer to as uh, paracetamol and in America they generally call Tylenol, uh, is the cause of autism, or a cause of autism. And uh, autism is a very complex uh, condition, most likely with a combination of genetic factors and other environmental factors as well. Um, but it's more, there is no real evidence to show that, that, that it's caused by a paracetamol uh, by, from, uh, um, <coughs> sorry, Pregnant uh, women um, taking paracetamol uh, causes autism. No evidence for that, really. Um, uh, proper scientific research does not show that. And so, um, but of course, this doesn't matter to the current, you know, politi political kind of climate in the US where everything has to be uh, politicized and real scientific research is ignored. Uh, it's a terrible thing that's that's going on in the US, the dumbing down of science, uh, which has been going on for a long time, uh, is ha going to have a major disastrous effect on the on the country and the health of the people. So there we are. Forewarned is forearmed, as they say. So uh, you know you know about it. If you are in the US, you should be getting your medical information not from the CDC anymore. I think you have to be in the NIH. You probably have to be looking to. Uh, other advanced countries uh, across the world that has superior medical information and uh, available on their websites now. All right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? Uh, I can see three and four. Three, four, three, four. Look at that, three and four. Nicely tucked away together there. Blocking across there and across there. And guess what we've got? That We'll put three and four into those squares and we've got the three blocking down here. So immediately we've got a three there and a four there. That's a good start. But we've also got two blocking up here. That will give us a two there. So we've got one there. And I haven't even mentioned the game yet. This is, of course, the Los Angeles Times expert level puzzle for Saturday. That block was easy. What can we do about the other blocks? Two across here and across there will give us two down there, two blocking, I mean. Seven uh, across this way, meaning that can't be seven. We're also going to have seven in one of these two squares here blocking back in this direction, right? Let's just take it across there and down there and seven blocking down there. So. There's a seven for us. I think I can hear a slight pittering and pattering of raindrops. So I guess it's just about to start to rain. Let's hope it's not too noisy. Okay, we've got five blocking this square and this square in the bottom row, so there's our five. Speaking of fives, we've got five across here, blocking across here, five blocking down there. It gives me a five in that square, five up, 
blocking up, blocking down, five blocking across there. Here's a five, five across this way, this way, and up here. I think we're looking for one, six, and nine in this row, aren't we? And one and six are in the same column. That means that the nine must be there. Ah, we've got a pair of five and nine block up here, five and nine block up there, and five and nine block across there. So that means that those two squares contain five and nine. How does that help us? I'm not sure, but it surely will. Uh, five and nine, and so seven then in that square and that square hmm. Didn't see it. Uh, I was hoping to see something there. Didn't see it. It might be there, just not spotting it. Let's uh, rock around the clock, shall we? Aha! Okay, we've got one blocking those three squares there, one blocking this square. So in this row, there's one. Uh, so three and six block down here, three and six block down here. So that's a pair of three and six in those squares there. That makes sense because that's a three or a six across there. Uh, so what goes up here then? Not three or six. Obviously, it's got to be four, eight, nine. Uh, do we get anything out of that? No, we do not. I don't think so. Uh, fours are there. Ah, uh, yeah, okay, we get the eight then. So... Actually, we've got uh, eight blocking down here, eight blocking down here, and eight across there. It means that that's going to be an eight. Uh, I said this is four, eight, and nine, and so we will be left with one, two, and five in those squares there. 
twos there. Five, two and five blocking up here actually, so that's got to be a one. Right. No completed digits yet, but don't panic, Mr. Mannering. Oh, I know, I was going to look at this block down here, wasn't I? Just think, uh, have another look at that. That was three and six, so this is one, four. Oh, no. okay. Well, we got one and four down here now. <laughs> Let's put the nine there. That's easy, wasn't it? You were shouting at me, do that silly thing there. Come on. All right done it now thank you very much for your help nine is blocking like this and across there we go I can hear my cat complaining. He hasn't been to the hospital today. He's going to go tomorrow for his weekly visit, his weekly torture. Three blocks up there, but it also blocks down this way, which puts three into one of these squares, which will block all the way up there. And three across there will give us three in that square. Sounds like that rain stopped. That wasn't much. Six blocking this square and six blocking this square in this column. So there's our six. Six across here, six blocking down there. There's another six and six down here, down there. Gives us six in that square there. Six across here. We have three and six in these in these two squares here. So that's going to be the six. That's going to be the three. What are we left with there? One, four, I think that is, isn't it? Um, so that means one and four. What are we what are we looking for? Seven, okay, seven blocking across there. There we go. Seven there. <coughs> Four blocking this square, so there's our four, there's our one, there's our one for that row. One up here, one blocking across there. Hey, come on, and there's one. Still haven't got any finished digits yet. Am I going to rectify that now? Yes, that's the final digit one. Six is one of our missing digits. In fact, six blocks across there. Let's put it in. Six goes there, six blocks up here and across there, which will give us six in that square. That's the last digit, six. Back down here for a three. Can't be many more threes to get. Ah, oh, yeah, okay. Let's see. Four blocks down here, so that gives us four in that square. And now we know that is the location of three. Three blocking up there, up there, and across there. Oh, rain starting again. One, three, and six are finished digits. Oh, so I've been coming up with a vengeance now. Uh, remember this was five and nine. Five and nine blocking up here. Five and nine blocking up. I'm going to have to shout now. Five and nine in those two squares. So this is whatever number is left. It's an eight.
two blocks this square, so in this row there's our two. Last number to get over here is four. As you hear the sound of the monsoon in the background. Four goes up, there's our four. Four blocking across here, four up here, four up there. There is four, that's the final digit, four. One number left down here, what are you? You're a seven. No, you, yes you are, so. And not much more to go. In fact, let's just click on the numbers that we still need. We still need a two. Can we get the two? Uh, well, we can get two blocking up here, and because two blocks up here, we know two is in one of those squares, so that can't get two. So we can say the two is there. I don't think we can finish the twos yet. We still need a five. We've got five blocking up here, which is five in that square, and five across here, and five up there. So that's not five, and if you remember this is a nine. And so nine blocking across there will give us a nine in that square. The missing number here is eight. Eight blocks across here, there's an eight. And eight down and up. Gives us eight in this square, eight blocking across there, there's our eight. Oh, I hear us, the sound of a meowing kitten. I'm trying to get into my neighbor's house for that one for rain. I hope she hears it. Two goes there. This is going to be a seven. Seven blocks up here. There's a seven. Missing digit. There's a two. Last number to place. There's a seven. And uh, not too much trouble with that. I think that's our expert level puzzle from the LA Times over for Saturday. Uh, see you around over the weekend. Um, and thanks once again for playing the old games during the week. Take care. Bye bye.